Let's talk about Robert Foster. Robert Foster is a former Mississippi State um, is a former Mississippi State representative and failed, thankfully, gubernatorial candidate. But he's got this place called Cedar Hill Farms. It's a, a frequent location for GO, GOP fundraising, um, and. He actually authored the state's death penalty law. So. Why am I bringing up Robert Foster? Well, let's start at the low one. Robert Foster, when he was running his failed gubernatorial candidate uh, campaign, sorry, his failed gubernatorial campaign, um, Foster refused to allow female journalists to ride on his campaign bus as male journalists were allowed. Um, so, so let's just set the bar, right? This is, this is some handmaiden's tale shit. It is, it is. I'm not going to get deep into it. We don't need to fucking analyze every single second of it. It's some handmaiden tale shit, right? He refused to allow female journalists on his bus, right? It's that's it's that simple. Male journalists were allowed, but female journalists can't be trusted. So that's the bar we're about to clear. And when I say we're about to clear this bar, it's like setting a hurdle at the base of a NASA launch platform. So we're, we're, we're going to clear it by a margin. You know, like, I know you're sitting there, Kai, like, I mean, how much bet worse does it get? Well, remember how I mentioned that, uh, Robert Foster authored the, um, Mississippi state, uh, uh, death penalty law. Well, he decided to take to social media, uh, over the weekend of last week, um, and state in his legal opinion that transgender people should be uh, executed by firing squad and that the law that he authored would allow the state to do it. So, you know, that. So when um, I inevitably, uh, Miss, uh, Mississippi, Mississippi, Yaka, Mississippi. When I inevitably get canceled by Twitch again for defending trans rights and gay kids and shit like that, because the last time I said that the GOP and the Republicans and the conservatives in this country are looking to kill gay kids, I got fucking canceled for violent hate speech on this platform for pointing out that they wanted to kill gay kids. So let me just point out again, in this man's own words, some of y'all still want to try and find political compromise with those that want to groom our school aged children and pretend men are women, etc. I think they need to be lined up against a wall before a firing squad to be sent to an early judgment. He then followed this tweet up with, I said what I said, the law should be changed so that anyone trying to sexually groom children and or advocating to put men pretending to be women in locker rooms and bathrooms with young women should receive the death penalty by firing squad. <sighs> he then, when Spencer Ritchie, the former head of the state party, tweeted in response, the fascist force is strong with this one. He then replied, spineless establishment rhinos like you have, co uh, have conceded every fight with the communists when you held power. Y'all conservatives haven't actually conserved anything. Now the godless have power and they are destroying our country. Soon we will have to deal with this directly. So... I have a local recording of this this time. Bitrate dropped there. Bitrate dropped. I watched it go red. I'm not shitting you. I expected this to fucking like drop. 
I'm truly expecting Twitch mods to shut this stream down. A hundred percent. Because the last time I pointed out that the GOP, the Republicans, the Christian right conservative in this country quite literally wants to kill gay kids. Wants to kill queer kids, transgender kids. Take your fucking pick of descriptor, of adjectives, of whatever. The last time I pointed this out, I got violent hate speech suspended. So I'm keeping a local copy this time. So when that shit happens, inevitably, I at least have proof that it wasn't me calling for violence. It was, in fact, me pointing out that the, uh, the right-wingers in this country are quite literally asking to execute trans people and gay people, etc., etc., etc. Because I've done it before and I got smacked around for it. So this time, I want evidence of it. This motherfucker is on Twitter talking about how, quote, they should be lined up on a wall before a firing squad and sent to an early judgment. Suck my dick. Fucking punk bitches. Swear to God. And Twitch is punk bitch mod staff made of tech bros who were too busy touching themselves to the hot tub streams fucking absolutely can go shove it up their fucking asses punk bitches <laughs>